Hi, my name is Dr. Keith Bilstein from Motion Wellness Chiropractic. I'm an animal chiropractor, and these are my horses here. But the reason I'm, this is our intro on the uh, video series that I put together last year on a horse called Tough. He's an eight-year-old quarter horse that had documented case of kissing spinous. So what to give you a history there, um, I ended up treating him for about a year and a half for the kissing spinous. He had a lot of tenderness, soreness throughout the withers and back area, and basically wondering if they're going to even be able to ride him again. So uh, I took that on, and, and he improved greatly. So and then he got to the point where he had all kinds of behavioral issues, where he was um, biting, kicking, rearing once in a while, and then... Um, would always buck when he went into a canner. So whoever rode him uh, was a little leery of what to do, you know. So And a after a while what happened is that I was confident that the horse was sound and didn't have any more problems from the kissing spinous. And I said to the owner, I said, you know what, I think you need to find a, a trainer and see if this is behavioral or more um, physical. And I thought it was more behavioral if anything so I needed so I felt it needed a lot of groundwork and just some retraining so the horse had been trained before so uh, what happened is that she couldn't find anybody the owner couldn't find anybody to train him so I decided last spring to say okay you know what I'll take on the horse because I'm confident this horse is sound so that's what I did so I took on the horse for uh, and did some training uh, I did groundwork and uh, training in in saddle so and this whole series is gonna um, I think there's somewhere between six and maybe ten videos that we put together um, and just so we can you can see the process I went through to, to retrain this horse and then the outcome of that so here it is a year later in the spring um, tw spring 2020 this happened and started in spring uh, 2019. So what I decided to do is uh, tape this or video it for the owner um, and that was all it was for. So we, we could, um, it was on private um, video so she could see some of the progress of the of the horse. So I decided that you know what people love watching uh, things like this so I thought it might be of interest for you guys so you can see some of the progress and how it all happened. So I guess bottom line is, you know, hopefully you'll uh, want to watch all the, the videos. Some of them are kind of long. I apologize, but that was just part of the session. I just recorded it and just let her go. So and that's how it will go. So just so you know, these are my horses here. I don't know if you can see the one over here. We've got Ellie. This is my mare. She's eight years old. She's a Frisian uh, Andalusian cross. And this is Bob. He's a Kentucky mountain. And then over there which i don't know if you can see at this point and you probably saw her, the black one she's a three-year-old uh, frisian andalusian cross that's actually ellie's baby so that's black betty which is now gray betty bob and ellie so again hopefully you can en enjoy this this series um i will and did i think there's a couple sections in there where you can see some chiropractic adjusting but ultimately most of it is just groundwork stuff. So if you don't want to see some of the groundwork and some of the training that uh, that we did, this is probably not for you, but I thought this would be of interest for most people. Again, I want to tell you, I am not a professional trainer by any means, So, but I just wanted to see what happens if we could get the groundwork uh, and retrained for this horse called Tough. Okay, so enjoy. We'll see you later. Bye-bye. And I think what I'm going to do with him today is take him around the round pen in a walk and then maybe a, a trot. I'm not going to, maybe a step or two in a canner, but I'm not really going to try to put him in a canner. So cause that's when he starts the bucks. But I think when most of this stuff is behavioral. So let's see what he does here. If I point. Good boy. 
And that's all I want him to do is, is walk. Stand. Good boy. And a boy. So we're still going here, so back. Let's see if he backs up. Back, 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 back up, back, back, back. Back. Good boy. So he doesn't like to be touched on his forehead at times, so it looks like back, back, good boy. Back. Back, 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 good boy. Nope, back, good boy. Back, back, ah boy, good boy. Good boy. Back, one more step. Back, good boy. Good boy. Back. Back. Good boy. So he's a little nervous right now. He doesn't know what to expect. So I'm going to click, point. So you should be seeing him hopefully. So, and right now he's just in a trot. Atta boy. So, and hopefully you can see this. It's a little dark out right now. So, sun's just setting. No, he's a little, he's looking at me like, I don't really want to do this. Okay, walk. Just, there we go. I got to walk out of him. Good boy. Out a good boy, buddy. Good walk. Walk. There's our walk. Good boy. And I don't know if you can see me maybe here. Hopefully I'm just going to stand here and he's just going to go around. There he's in a canter. And you see it, there's no buck there at all. It does arch his back a fair amount though when he does. Walk. Walk. Good boy. And a boy. There we go. That's what I want to do. Just get him to walk. This is what I want to do here in just a second. See if I can draw into him. And get him to turn.
I think I'll see if I can draw him in here. Good boy. He knows how to turn. Boy, he's got a sh canner. He's cannering. It's a short scanner, and I don't really want him cannon here because it's kind of wet. But Walk, walk. You try that next time, I'm going to heat, put some pressure on you. Walk. Nope. See if I can draw him in here to turn. That a boy. That a boy. Good boy. Walk. Good boy. That a boy. Good boy, bud. You can walk. I'm just gonna let him go around here. you to turn in. Atta boy. Atta boy. Okay, I'm going to turn him in here around this gate, see what he does. Oh, that's good here. See if I can get him to draw in. Atta boy. Nope. Atta boy. There's your canner again. A little choppy. But he's got to learn how to do this again. <laughs> 